When it comes to dingo hoppers, I'm a regular encyclopedia. <laughs> so that you want to have a hand, you like the folks who live up there and now to fluff their wings. <laughs> well, you're absolutely dandy if you use one of these handy little things. Pick up the Pick up the dingo hopper just like so. Throw the wind twirling now. Give it a little yank, and there you go. You're what they call the dogs. Meow. Wonderful stuff. The human stuff. Can't get enough of human stuff. And we're the authority. No need for us to buff because we're great at explaining human stuff. What's that? A snark black. Wow. Just by chance, suddenly life was laudied up. are what she used to make folks dance. Give it a blow and then pull up. Wonderful stuff, that human stuff. If you're a buff, a human stuff. Complete the A of J. Which sounds absurd, but take my word, that's what the humans say. Careless and 
reckless behavior, the entire celebration was We're going to completely destroy you. That culture was going to be the pinnacle of my distinguished career. Sebastian. But I didn't mean to. Ariel, listen. You've been given a gift. Your mother's voice. It's a wondrous talent. One that demands stewardship and care. So please, dear child, for the sake of your memory. I know, Daddy. I know. And it wasn't even Ariel's fault. We're going to come right back, but then Seagull kept going on and on about human stuff. Seagull? Human stuff? You went up to the surface. Um, nothing happened. You could have been seen by one of those barbarians. Daddy, they're not barbarians. They're dangerous. Next, harpoons, you're my youngest. I'm old enough to look after myself. As long as you live under my roof, you will obey my rules. Oh, you're so unfair. If only you would just listen to me for once. She's as stubborn as a barnacle. Teenagers, give them an inch and they swim all over you. I can go over a kingdom, but I can't even control my own daughter. Maybe I was too harsh. Nonsense, sir. If you ask me, you haven't been tough enough. I haven't? Ariel needs constant supervision. Someone to watch over her to keep her out of trouble. That's not a bad idea. I say it's a right good one. And you are just the crap to do it. What? You heard me. From now on, Ariel is your responsibility. My but your majesty! She's a clever mermaid! I'm just a crustacean! Should we want to pick some higher on the evolutionary ladder? <laughs> Seaweed is always green. 
friends to kiss you. If you do, you'll stay human forever. If I don't? You'll turn back into a mermaid and your soul will be mine forever. Life's full of tough choices, isn't it? Of course, there is one more thing. My fee. But I don't have any. Oh, I'm not asking for much. Only your voice. But if they gave away my voice, how will I ever? You'll have your looks, your pretty face, and don't ever underestimate the importance of body language. Come on. Huh? 
Oh, you don't speak at all. Sorry, for a moment, I mistook you for somebody else. Oh, what is it? You're hurt? No, no, need help? Well, I've got just the remedy. A warm bath and a hot meal. Come on now, how's and far? Please don't worry. That's what I call. Oh, now I've got to follow her. This is going to get me in real hot water. Can you believe that guy? What a crap. <laughs>
can whisper, sing, or shout without so much as a word. Try it. Go on. Like so. Just let your emotions tell your body what to do. See how much a single gesture can reveal. And every little step, every single step is one step closer to saying what you feel. You got it! 
Well, we ought to get back anyways. Got to rest up for my birthday tomorrow. Old Grimsby's planning a ball to help me find that girl with that voice. He wants me to be married by sunset or else. Give her back to me. 
to me. Not on your life. It so happens that your daughter made a bargain. No. Swapped her voice to lend a man up where it's dry. Is it binding goodness? Yes. Unbreakable unless less. There is a little something we could try. Go on. Yes, perhaps we could arrange a sort of trade off. Maybe swap your daughter's soul or say your own. What? Make the steel and set her free, or else she comes with me to suffer through eternity alone. It's not my soul that you love, it's my power. Now which would you rather be, the king of the sea or a father to his little girl? The trident is a big responsibility, Ursula. Nonsense, trite one, hand it over! Finally, the oceans belong to me! And now you pour a fortune and soul. Time's up. You're through. Now the power of Poseidon has been once again made full. All the magic of the dragon and the shell and I control. Now Joshua and her over ocean, sea, and shore. Now save yourself a benefit field. You pour.
just you and me.